They say one man's trash is another man's treasure. Well, in this next story, it turns out everybody's trash is this guy's art. He combines art with science to create some amazing mechanical sculptures. And almost all of it is made out of stuff that he found. getting painted. Hi. Is that yours? It's pretty much the perfect exhibit for a place like Science World that likes, we like to play with the boundary between art and science. It's all about creative invention. It's all about seeing things in a slightly different way and seeing the possibilities in things. Form a golf stick for ears? Can you see how it'll work? Yep, there's, there's switches on the thing that's making it move. Kids are such creatures of detail. They will literally slow down and peer at the sculpture, finding little details in it, pointing out details to each other. Microphone. What is on my screen? Drawn? A piano? A violin? Um, I forgot when the other things are called. Upcycling. A way to figure out new uses for old things. What is it? The wheel! It does kind of make everyone of all ages think outside the box. That guy's making a bowling pin, and that one is hitting a piece of wood, and that one, and that one is lifting something up. Tweety is practically um, making the cats and the dogs dance. <laughs> The exhibit is called Creativity in Motion, Springs, Sprockets, and Pulleys. And you can see it now at Vancouver Science World. Enjoy the art, learn a little about science along the way, find out all about it at scienceworld.ca.